guys welcome back to the channel hunter what are we we're excited we're fired up man oh, yeah because guys this is the five tools that you must have from harbor freight now guys this isn't like the usual ones these are some bigger items from harbor freight that we believe that you should you should check out you should buy we believe they're good products we put it we put it to the test, haven't we? Oh, yeah. And guys, make sure you stay tuned in this video because we're going to show you the giveaway. Like, we've done our first giveaway of the year so far to the to the cl the shop class. So, we, we got a little bit of film of that. So, we'll put it in here in this video. But, without further ado, guys, I want to say this first, though, okay? Right, Hunter? Yep. I'm, getting I'm so fired up, I want to go on into it. But, I've got to say this, guys. Thank you. We thank every one of you for all your support because you do that helps us be able to give this stuff away to these young adults and uh, it, it just fires me up. It, I love doing it. Hunter loves doing it. That was probably the happiest day we had in a long time. Oh yeah, because remember, dream big. Dream big, guys. It don't cost a bit more. But uh, we were we were fired up that day. We got to give it away. That made our day. It really did. It did. And guys, uh, and we'll put a link of the YouTube, hopefully, if we can figure out how to do that, to their YouTube, because they they done an interview with us. Check it out, you know. I don't know if it's out yet or what. I don't know yet. We'll, we'll see. But guys, if so, just check out their YouTube and like and subscribe, you know. It's a high school's YouTube. But um, you know what's cool, though, guys? is I'm so fired up about this video, I can't even think about what I'm going to say. I know. I mean, I can't even think. But guys, thanks for buying the keychains and all the merch. Thanks for helping us out and give to these kids. And we got so much more to give to them that I'm so excited. I cannot wait. We we moved the one box that we're going to give away to before Christmas. Don't yep. you think we'll give it That's away? That's the best time. Yeah, best time. So it'll be kind of like an early Christmas gift before they go on Christmas break. But without further ado, here we go. Now, you want me to go on? Yeah, you can go on. Can I? Because I'm so fired up. Guys, we, I, our first item of the five is this right here. We never gave the credit to well, this. Well, we've been using it and wanted to test we, it. We've done a video on putting it together. And uh, but we never really uh, said our thoughts, guys. This is a must-have, I believe, that from Harbor Freight. If you do, if you work on that, it bikes. is the Yukon multi-purpose workbench with LED light. Yeah, and guys, I'm telling you, it, it's not hard to put together. No, um, it's we've been wearing it out. We use this thing a lot, especially for our second channel. Yeah, for our second channel, we use it a lot. Right now, here, Cross Customs Armory. Yeah. Guys, if you're not subscribed to that one, go subscribe. We just have fun on that one. It's it's just so and we have fun. some epic things coming for that channel. Yeah, we do. We really do. But um, but we we use this thing. It's really nice. If you could work on whatever you want to work on on it, I don't not know an how, engine or anything, but I don't lightweight know how you stuff could do like you couldn't really do. I don't know how a carburetor cleaner or something like that would do on it. You just put it on like a rags down or something. Yeah. I wouldn't I go wouldn't through do this it board. on this. On this, I that's would. why we use this to work on. Yeah, when we what we work on, we use this mat. But guys, this thing's awesome because you can always use these little peg systems. These come with it, right? Yeah. Uh, no, none no? of them came with it. Nothing? I had those. Okay. Well, you can use these little peg systems, and you can put your tools up there. Any pegboard item, because that's pegboard. Yeah, and, and it like, has the LED light. We got the drill it. holder. I mean, we we put some stuff. It's got a nice light. I mean, look at this. You yeah. can see what kind of difference it makes. Turn on. Yeah, I mean, it makes a big difference. It's a nice light to do work. It's and got, it leaves room for storage up top. Yeah, we we just store our stuff up Second here. channel stuff. And then, you know, you got two drawers. You got, and we keep our, the, our beautiful icon. icon. We look, this is probably one of the coolest tools that Harbor it's Freight It's really sells. good. Yeah, we keep that in there and like our Harbor Freight little hammer. Of course, Hunter's Goad Ratchet. Yeah. I don't know what in the world that is. Second channel stuff. Uh, second channel yeah. stuff. Yeah, <laughs> all that second channel stuff. But and then it's, we got have two, this. it's got two drawers. Yep. Second channel stuff. It's all second channel stuff. <laughs> second channel stuff. But it's got a nice storage shelf down here. We got it loaded down with bags. Second channel stuff. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's all we could say. That's all we could say, guys. But, I mean, this right here is a wonderful, wonderful table, though. Workbench. It's nice. It really works good. I mean, it, 
whatever you do, you can do anything on this. I built something on this. I just can't say what it is on this channel. No, we do not talk about that on this channel. But but it was built on this table and it did great. Yeah, and uh, we we do a lot of things on this. We have done a lot of things. On yeah. This. But uh, like we do all of our comparisons, we yeah. do. We, I mean, look, I mean, I have my tools from putting one of our items it's together. That toolbox together. Yeah. But, I mean, we use it. We use it every day almost. We do. We really do. And, guys, I believe it's one of the first items that we're going to say is one of the must-haves from Harbor Freight. Is this workbench. It's really great. You must have it. I mean, it's a, what does this thing cost? $129? $119, I think. $119. You can get it on sale though. You can. We got it for what? One oh nine? Yep. We got it for one oh nine. It it's worth it, I believe, if you're gonna do things and you need somewhere to work. But you know, I would not like do a bunch of chemicals on not it. Not chemicals <laughs> or heavy duty stuff because this is like a it's I a, don't know what kind it's of a wood little, it's is. wood like a it's got a coating, you know like those cabinets. Yeah, it's not get. like strong wood at all. No. But for what we use it for, it works perfect. So, guys, let's get to the next item. Let's do it. All right, guys, before we go to the shop to show you some more items, I wanted to go ahead and show you this one because this one to us was a must-have. We it's had, a game changer. We had to have this to change what we were doing, and uh, it really paid off. Like, this thing is absolutely... It's the full bank service card. Yeah. The What is it? Six US drawer. Yeah, US, US drawer. drawer. Six drawer. It's nice. Full bank service car. It is like... We need more organization. Yeah. I mean, we're working on it. We, we well, took some of our tools out to work on his yeah. Jeep. We got to put them back in here. But, uh, you know, that's one thing bad about... That's one thing bad about second channel stuff. <laughs> but that's one thing bad about, like, working all the time is, like, you forget to put stuff back. Yeah, we just we have our anyway. time. Yeah. Um, but if you look up here, we well, how we do it is we keeping our sockets up here, which we've got a lot out. I mean, but they're 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 oh, in the they're the here. case for it, but just yeah. Not and this. I mean, we keep that. We keep like I think that's a multimeter. Yep, that's and a our climb. flashlights, uh, you know, pry bars, and more flashlights. Another flashlight, trays, magnets, mirrors, weird ratchets, knives, <laughs> other mirrors. You know, we keep. We keep that kind of stuff up here. All kinds of magnets we have. Yeah, they're good know. to have. But guys, then you know, of course, you have the next drawer down. We keep some more, or all of our sockets. More sockets, ratchets, and scissors. ratchets, scissors. These beautiful. Ow! <laughs> these you be these more things, careful. <laughs> these things. The shop shears <laughs> are awesome. <laughs> How it shanked me. This is awesome. The scraper. We haven't even talked about that yet. No. Oh, goodness. Did I get something away? It's okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, guys, then, then, of course, you know, you got to have room for stuff. We have our... I know some of y'all might have saw this drawers before. That's why we're not going very Yeah, we're not going in depth. But, but we're just showing what you can do you with can, it. We Honestly, we need, we need to organize the rest of our stuff. I'm telling you, this thing, though, look at that. Look at all that. That looks pretty good. That's a lot of stuff. We still have tons of room in there, too. Yeah, we could do another one. But don't tell me I need to buy more tools. Oh, yeah. Then all of our power tools. Might as well put this one up right here. Might as well get put it back with the Hercules. We got, you know, power tools in there and stuff like that. And then down at the bottom, I don't know what we got in there. Oh, uh, our Harbor Freight heat gun. And then our uh, digital scanner. Yeah, digital scanner, Harbor Freight grinder. Uh, some more tools some more tools <laughs> but you know how it is guys you got to have the room but the quality of the powder coat on this is amazing yeah this box though this box is a is truly a must have if you it how you know how you've seen this box and it's and it's back like that again yeah but that's a lot of stuff that needs thrown away that, and a lot of stuff that's just like our paper towels i just threw them over there and like stuff that needs to go to work or yeah. actual job. Yeah, and, and stuff we got to put back in this box. Yeah. That we just threw on top of that one because it was in a hurry. But if you have a more of a budget to get this one, like where you're able to spend a little more in storage, you can this get is a great. good deal on this whenever they have those uh, sidewalk sales sometimes. Like parking lot sale. Parking lot sales, sidewalk. Why can't <laughs> we say that? I don't know. <laughs> Because they never put a sale out there on the parking lot. It's always inside. They used to. <laughs> they used to back in the day. But uh, this thing right here is worth the money. Uh, and the black trim looks I don't good. even know how much this thing costed us. 
I think we got a deal on it. Yeah, we got it cheaper because there's a coupon going on or something. Yeah, and, and you can get it cheap. You can get it for four hundred and something dollars, I believe. If, yeah. With the coupon, if not, it's like five ninety nine. I think. I think we paid four ninety nine. I think. No, I think it's or four seventy nine. Yeah. So I can't remember. Exactly. It was a good deal, and I believe it's worth the money. This is one thing that I think my number two of some not number thing, no. It's, the one you're saying is right now. Because, you know, guys, I couldn't do a top five. No. I don't think. There's too many good things. Too many. But this is one of my favorite items, though. I really like it. And I like the white. The white, white looks good. A lot of people said uh, the white will show dirt. A lot of dirt. And I'm like, if you're working around a lot of cars, then yes, it would. But in this garage and ours at the house. Everything's don't. outside. We put Everything's outside. In here stays pretty controlled. Besides all the storage, we store a lot in this garage. Yeah, we do. It's mostly storage. But I love the bumpers on it. Yeah. Good I solid. Mean, nice right there. And I like how it says U.S. General down it. Yeah, it's a nice and touch. And the black trim. I mean, it's like, you know, it's nice. I really do like it. I wanted to do the, uh, what was I wanting to do with this box? We still might do it, so we're not going to so say. So don't tell them? No. Okay, I won't tell them. But guys, I have a pretty cool idea, or a nerdy idea. I don't know what it would be. To me, it's a cool idea. <laughs> <laughs> now you know what let's something we haven't said in a long time what's that let's go to the original shop yeah let's go up there check some stuff out this is home sweet home to me i mean we haven't been here in a while which we will be getting back here soon things are starting to settle down a little bit where we can get to work on some of these vehicles you and know, see if we can use some harbor freight tools to build these things. yeah that's what we're going to do turn around and show them the view for the ones that have not seen our car if you're not seen we got this camaro that looks pretty rough. <laughs> we have the Freedom Nova, which we're going to try. We're going to weld that with the Harbor Freight. Um, what is it? We don't know yet. One of the welders. One we of have the, the central machine one, but we want to try to get the, what's the other one? The green one. The green one. I can't think of the name. Titan? Yep, Titan. So we're going to try that out. But the next tool that we believe you must have is this right here. Oh, yeah. The ultrasonic cleaner. This thing, we've used it to clean bolts, parts, brackets. It's been very good. I don't even know if there's stuff still in it. Oh, yeah, it still has fluid in it. Oh, it's down a lot. It evaporates. See? Oh, well, I think it's up when you have something in it. <laughs> yeah, it goes up. But uh, it's pretty sweet. You just control it right through here. Should we uh, turn it on? I think we should put something in it and then uh, for a minute. And then get back with them and show them the difference. All right, let's do it. How much do, do, does this thing cost? Um, did we pay around one twenty for this thing? Yes, I think it was around one hundred and twenty dollars. We've had this thing for a while. We've actually used it quite a bit. We torture test it. We, we did. put a, a brake master cylinder out of the F one four. Right there. This right here. Show, show the camera. We ran we ran through it and freed it up. It yeah, was totally it sealed. Now. And uh, that thing works now. So uh, that tells you. It works you, good. That tells you it works good. So we'll throw something in it that's pretty filthy. And see if it'll get it clean pretty quickly. We, yeah. I so mean, we don't know. We don't know. I've, we ain't used it in a while. Normally, it, you let it run for a while and then, but we're going to see if Sometimes it'll you got to run it twice. We'll see then, if I do it quick. So let's yeah, do it. Let's do it. All right, guys. This is an old bearing that we took out of a 327. And I mean, it's shot. So, but we're going to, I want you to look at that right there, how bad it, it looks and nasty. And we're going to run this for five minutes. Five, we got set for five minutes on whatever that is. Let's turn the temp up. Yeah, right. Oh, right, let's go to 80. I really don't know how this thing works, but we'll turn it all the way up. Because why not? And then we will drop this in the basket. Uh, is there anything else in there? Probably I don't need to look, don't we? Okay, no. no. That's it. Then what we have in there is what? Uh, Purple. Zip. Zip, yeah. Okay, ready? So then you press. Nope, let's turn it off. Listen to that, though. That is a weird sound. Someone says there's something you can do to make the sound dissipate. It's oh, really? a certain thing. I can't remember what they said, but there is a certain way. So we'll leave this for five minutes, guys. We'll get back with you, and we'll take it out and see what it looks like. All right, guys, the ear pierce noise is over. <laughs> so uh, We'll see if five minutes was long enough. I, yeah, we don't, I, I don't know if it was But you can see this theme, can't you? Oh, yeah, I don't know if you can see that on camera, but it's hot. might be a little warm. Oh, my goodness. Try not to get it on the red part of the box. 
It would only clean it. Look at that. I'm going to wipe that down. The inside, it really done a number, but you can see where that thing was worn Oh, yeah, out. it's not good, but... Oh, yeah. I cleaned it pretty good. For five minutes. Five minutes, guys. Look at that. You could tell this thing was wore out at 327. Show the other side. Yeah, that still looks a lot better than what it did. Oh, I know. That's five minutes, guys. You could have left that in there. But, I mean, th this we, we were no. not using anyways. But uh, you could have left that in there and, and done a number on that. But I was really needing that to see so I could find that number on there. Yep. What I was needing anyways to buy parts to rebuild that motor. All I'm saying is that thing works really well. Yeah, this thing right here, this is the basket you put smaller things in. If you if you need to put something bigger in, you just leave the basket out. And you just put and it you in just there. drop it in. But the basket comes in handy. Um, like that right there, you just plug it up. We never leave it plugged up though. Nope. We don't leave anything plugged when up. We're up done, here. We unplug it. But that right there is a must-have from Harbor Freight. If you do any kind of mechanical work on old or anything really because yeah. it can happen the new cars too he I, I got this old box dirty i mean clean really but uh look at that yeah it's nasty that we need to clean that box but uh this is one thing that i believe from harbor freight that you really need but you know if you work on the car kind of cars that we work on like these old camaros old novas old fords you got to have this kind of stuff to, like, honestly, if we didn't have this, we'd never would have freed up that uh, brake master cylinder on a 51 Ford F1. Nope. Because I don't, I've been trying to find one. I think I finally found one at uh, Summit. But, I mean, they're hard to find. That exact truck might one. be leaving the channel. Yeah. Guys, if you want a piece of Price Customs, we got that truck up for sale. Yep. And it comes with an extra cab to fix whatever if you want to. And but if it don't sell in a month, we're it, keeping it. Yeah, like if it does not sell in 30 days, which we put it on, what, how many days a ago? A week ago. A week ago. We're just taking it back off and keeping it. It's, we're just seeing if we can. Yeah, we there's can something I want so bad. The only way I'll buy it is if I get rid of that. Um, we don't want to get rid of that. We but. don't want to get rid of that, but if i want it's one of those you know the other thing you want more <laughs> yeah but guys this is top notch from harbor freight i'm glad they started selling some good ones these these are good don't they have a smaller one too yeah they for do like jewelry yeah and stuff but, but yeah guys pick you up one of these they're about 100 and 20. I, don't, I don't know about when we bought it it was 120. Uh, guys they're good this video we're doing a little bit bigger items but guys no one ever talks about the five things you need from harbor freight that's big we're going to because there is some things that you need from Harbor Freight that's bigger than just, uh, you know, hand tools because there's tons of hand tools you need, but also you need some stuff like this and this next item we're going to show so you. So let's get to let's it. Let's do it. Hey guys, to all y'all that are new to the channel that's come along with tools, uh, check this out. This is a motor that we built, Manhunter's first engine we ever built in our lives. And we did use Harbor Freight tools we building did. this thing. Uh, torque wrench, all that from Harbor Freight. We built that right there and that thing is a beast can't wait to get on the road can't wait i mean this thing's a monster i cannot wait to get it on the road and then we, of course we have the camaro we used a lot of harbor freight tools so let's get going so this next item with us working with old cars like we said all these old rusty cars like this one's very 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 rusty you don't even want to see the inside it's rusty <laughs> but we you have to use certain tools that are required for older vehicles that are rusty and this is one right here this is the uh, central, uh, wait, it's a 40 pound capacity four blast cabinet. So it's a sandblaster cabinet. And it has where you put the gloves in there, but where we haven't been up there in a while, I'm afraid what's inside the gloves. So I'm not gonna stick <laughs> my hands in there, but it has this cabinet right here if you'll look through this glass. I think it's very dirty right now because we use this. There's thing. a table in there with a gun, and you actually use the sandblaster and it works good. But this thing, was a pain in the butt to put together. Yeah, that's one thing I have to say. It was a negative in that sense. Like, we didn't even get it together correctly. We just used what we... We had to find parts. Is this parts missing? Yeah, there were parts missing. And it, But, guys, we put this thing, if you want to go back in our old videos, we put this thing up against the snap-on. Soda right blaster. There. Soda blaster. And, I mean, I have to say the... Uh, this sandblaster works better than a soda and blaster. That soda blaster makes a mess. Like yes, that. gosh, we did not know that. But this thing works really good. Like we cleaned brackets. Oh, we, we done some really good stuff. stuff. With it. 
it works really good and it don't take that much sand to put in yeah and to make it even better we put that on there oh yeah Guys, you got to get you one of them. Go to pricecustoms.com and get you one today. <laughs> no, but I really do think this is a good thing to have. But putting it together is a pain. It took us like two hours to do. I hated putting it together. And we had a fine It was part. absolutely terrible to put together. And every person on YouTube we saw put it together, they complained. It's a pain in the butt to put together. So, other than that, though, it's good. I mean, it's good After using. After it's together. After together, it's good using. I'll but, tell you one thing. And you could do modifications on here. Which I think this. theirs is a little bit different now. Yeah, I know. Because this I, is the older one. But it's still. What's the modifications? Well, every one, which we done found out, yeah. puts a new light in it. Because, because this one's very dim inside of it. It's very well, that dim. light went out, like, it in did using go, it. But it was dim off the bat. Yeah. It wasn't very bright. So it needs a new light in it. But, I mean, it works good. Yeah, a lot of people just put an LED in there. And um, and and then it's got a spot where you can, right here, that you can hook your shot back and suck the dust. So and, it makes so it you easier can see to see. Better. Yeah. Hey, we're, we're going to do that kind of stuff once we get, we got, guys, we got to organize this garage so we can it's get back bad. to work up here. Because we got a lot of tests we want to do on some tools and see if they work. But where we've been so busy, like being at the hospital and everything, we haven't been able to even be here. No, we so haven't. This is like the first time of us coming back here. It, it feels it's good it does. because this is where we started. This is like, look, I mean, we got parts. We have this races. This is the shop we started in. You know, we got all this stuff. But, you know, we've been enjoying yes. filming at home. Oh, so. I have. But in all the ones that have been praying and everything for my papa, he is now home and he's doing a lot better. But keep him in your prayers. He still is going through a lot. Of yeah. So, uh, but we thank you. We all. do thank you. Uh, but guys, this is a must have if you have a shop and you need to work on old stuff that's rusty to get the rust off. What did we do? We done a pulley off a water pump. Yep. And then we that, painted it. And it looks good. It looks brand new. I'm like, hey, that's the best way to do it. Take an old part. Sandblast it, paint it, looks brand new. Yeah, uh, that's the way to do it, guys. So we have another item. The which, last item. Yeah, which is back at the other play, <laughs> the other shop. Shop at, at our house. Yeah. But, uh, so let's go there and talk about this last item. Yeah, let's do it. The last item we think is so great that you must have that we even had it in our last video, and it is the five drawer. The Series 3 five drawer. It's so good that we're like, we have to include it in five things you must have. And I know some people might say, you already showed a toolbox. But I think totally you different. honestly need both of these because this you can move around towards your cars and stuff easier than the six full bank six, six drawer. Yeah. And this one is very nice. We still need to flip these around. Like we said, we've been busy. But uh, very nice quality. I'm not going to go too much in detail because y'all saw, saw it last video. Last video. It's pretty nice. 30 inch five drawer there's instructions nice quality uh rubber mats in there guys if you don't know we have the series the we have the series two at the other garage and uh it's not as nice as the series three i have to say and the blue i love but the black trim is what makes the series yeah. three so great and i think it's a little bit it was easier to put together and i like the black hardware it just went a whole lot better and i think it might be a little bit better I think so too. Three. So I mean, honestly, series three, I really do recommend. So guys, make sure you get you one if you want one, and like, subscribe. But also, we're gonna throw in the videos. We filmed as much as we could, but um, we we're excited about it. We want you guys to see it. So we're gonna throw it in here right now. So let's do it. All right, guys, we're fired up that we're heading right now for the first giveaway of this year. Yep. And uh, we got the stuff. We got some of the stuff loaded right and here. We're loaded down. Yeah. We're, we're going up here to the high school. I don't know how much we can film, but we're just glad to be able to do this. Uh, we got the permission to come today. So, you know, there's a lot of steps when it deals with students. You got to keep them safe. That is number one. Yes. So we have to get permission, go through the channels to come to be able to do what we do. And we love it. And we're excited. I'm like, I'm like as happy like Christmas morning. As you say, I'm all fired up. I'm all fired up. You know what I'm saying? But uh, so guys, uh, well, we'll see if we can film some when we get there. So let's go. Wow, look at this view, man. This school has the prettiest view. The mountains uh, is the place to be. I mean, the prettiest view in the world. Oh yeah. Yeah, let's get it. So here. We're, we just got here, so yeah, let's go in and let's do it. get it done. 
So what are y'all doing? So get this ready for them. This is for the shop class here. Let's just take this and we'll come back here for it. All right, guys. Well, we're here with the with the shop, the shop teacher right here. He's he's a cool guy right here. And these guys are aw and oh, ladies yeah, awesome. here are awesome. And we want to thank all them for letting us do this and thank you all for making this possible. And we appreciate it. Make sure you like and subscribe. Well, we hope you guys enjoyed that the clips we had of that. It was a lot of fun. We really do appreciate it. And guys, make sure you go to Hair Child School's uh, YouTube page and check them out. Like and subscribe to them as well. But guys, let us know what you thought about this video, what you want to see next, and it don't cost a bit more to dream big than it does little. And I'll dream big. Because I serve. A big God. So guys, really comment down below what you want to see next. And, and let us know what you think about the five items that we picked yeah. that we think you must have. And what's five items you would pick that you need from Harbor Freight? Big items. Yeah, big items like we did in this one. I know the ultrasonic's small, but it's actually like a bigger item. Like Price-wise. Price-wise. So, guys, make sure you like, subscribe, comment down below, and we'll see and you next time. Thanks for watching, boys and girls.